There were dogs everywhere in Kelowna's City Park on Sunday morning for the Scotiabank BC SPCA Pause for a Cause. Oh wow, this is phenomenal. We're so, so stoked to see uh, so many vendors here supporting us. We've got 11 awesome vendors here, uh, including Bark and Fly and Axe Monkeys and Davis Tees and a few others. And then of course, we are delighted to see almost 200 participants and volunteers and staff just coming together here in City Park on a great sunny day to just celebrate our love for animals and also our mission to protect and enhance the quality of life for animals in British Columbia. It's phenomenal. Oh, I've been here uh, many years uh, supporting the SPCA. It's just a great event uh, and uh, a great number of people that really want to make sure that all British Commons know uh, violence against their pets is uh, not acceptable. I think we've been here uh, every year that we can. I don't think we've missed one. Uh, and uh, both uh, Norm and I had responsibilities as Minister of Agriculture, former Ministers of Agriculture of the province, had the responsibilities for the SPCA and their legislation. So helped enhance uh, the work they do, continue to support their capital efforts and, and enhancing their facilities. So uh, just to, we know uh, how important this is. The, the BCSPCA Scotiabank Pause for a Cause, the, the funds directly help our local branch here in Kelowna. Uh, about 85 cents of every dollar that come in are, are going to help the most urgent cause, medical rehabilitation, as well as uh, the rehoming efforts that we take on to help dogs and cats. And we actually have a couple pot belly pigs in the shelter. This year's event raised over $20,000 for the Kelowna branch of the BCSPCA. For Castanet News, I'm Rob Balston in Kelowna. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net.